Tech Stock says this week's overnight closures are set to last until Thursday night. Crews are working to move barriers to create a traffic switch and construction in this area will likely continue for the next couple of months. We realize it's an important commuter route for especially for people who work on Fort Bliss and our, our local soldiers use it and um, we, we don't take closing it lightly. Take a look at this video courtesy of TechStot. This is what the traffic will look like if you're heading west. Once this week's overnight closures are done, eastbound traffic will be moved to the westbound lanes. Now, over the last year, crews have been working on resurfacing the road. They're also creating a V-shaped ditch in the center median to prevent erosion. Also adding cable barriers and a metal beam guard fence as safety improvements. Now, all of this construction is being done in order to make some improvements to Trans Mountain's lifespan. According to TechStot, Trans Mountain was built in the 70s and hasn't undergone a major upgrade like this in quite some time. You know, it's it's undergone some maintenance work, of course, over the years, but it is definitely uh, time for the improvements that we can make on it, especially when it comes to the structural capacity of that roadway, meaning the longer road life. That's an important investment to make on that highway. And TechStock says because of this traffic switch, the picnic tables on both sides of the mountain will be closed off for the next two months. The project, however, is on schedule, set to be completed in the next six months. From Trans Mountain, Brianna Chavez, ABC7.